my name is Elsa Munguia. Hola, yo soy Elsa Munguia, la directora del Mariachi Los Tigres. And behind me, you have Mariachi Los Tigres from Carroll High School. Yeah. I'm Lulu Chapa. I'm Mark Yamas. I'm Emilio Rivero. I'm Angie Aguilar. I'm Justin Garcia. I'm Jeremiah Falon. I'm Christian Trujillo. I'm Michael Lopez. I'm Ryan Munoz. I'm Ray Morales. We are the Mariachi Los Tigres. Mariachi Los Tigres first began before COVID years, <laughs> and we actually had to stop um, Mariachi Los Tigres because of COVID and for the safety of our students and them staying home and learning online. So once we got over COVID, we brought our students back together, and this is what you see today. <laughs> Our, our students are all musically inclined. They're in different uh, music groups, not just mariachi. So you'll find them in the band hall. You'll find them in the guitar room. You'll find them in orchestra. And you also find them in choir. Some of them um, have taken the leap and done a little bit of acting as well. So you'll find our students are very well-rounded in the arts. Um, all of them have been, had a big passion for mariachi since the beginning. and. Without them, we wouldn't have Mariachi Los Tigres today. There has been mariachi here in the district before. Um, when I was growing up, we had mariachi at Ray High School. There was mariachi at uh, Miller High School, mariachi at Moody High School. But through the years, the programs have kind of vanished as teachers moved around and others didn't take over the program and the culture and the importance of keeping a mariachi in a school. And so Mariachi Los Tigres kind of brought that back. Uh, for everyone and so our vision was to have full-time mariachi programs at every single school and so since Mariachi Los Tigres has began their inception of playing um, all the other high schools have kind of jumped on board and the last school to get mariachi is going to be Veterans High School this year and they actually hired a director specifically just for mariachi and they will be teaching a little bit of band, but also mariachi. And then the overall vision is to have full-time mariachi programs at all the high schools and all the middle schools. So we would have a director just specifically for mariachi classes. I think that it kind of draws everything together. A lot of times our students are not aware of the history of their ancestors and the journeys that they took to be here in this country. And a lot of our music is very rich in culture and tells a lot of the stories about those journeys that our families took. So I think that it just really ties in, you're here because your ancestors took a journey a long time ago and took a chance to come to this country. If your son or daughter is interested in taking mariachi here at Carroll High School, uh, it's as easy as contacting the school and they will contact me and I will be happy to answer any questions you might have. Oh, yeah. Yeah,